If you want to be a broadcast journalist, you should have a basic understanding of how to shoot and how to edit and how to produce and how to write and the performance aspect of being on camera if you if you want to be on camera. You have to know the basics of all of those things. It sounds like a lot, but I think it's necessary. And then find one or two that you really excel at, that you're a specialist. So maybe you're a great editor and a great writer and you have base, the basics of everything else. Maybe you're a dynamite shooter and your on-camera performance is really strong. So just identify a couple things that are your strengths do them really well, and then for the others, just have a basic understanding of how they work. Relationships are really key, always, but especially if you're freelance, and that was something I learned as a freelancer, and that was a skill that I really was able to, to hone and develop when I was freelance. Um, you've gotta make sure that people know you. You know there's that saying, it's not what you know, it's who you know. It's also who knows you, you know, because people have to, when you email them, they have to know who you are, who's emailing them. When you call, they have to know who that is. And they have to know what to expect from you, they have to know the quality of your work, your temperament, your personality, all of those things. Now, you should be true to yourself. So maybe someone is really aggressive and, you know, go-getter and someone else is aggressive in a, in a little calmer way. I mean, you gotta be true to your personality but you have to nurture those relationships. You have to. People that you're afraid of and intimidated by, you still gotta email them and see if they wanna go out for coffee because that's key. Relationships make the world go round.